Dr. Gary Linkov here from City Facial Plastics. Wanted to talk to you about the recovery process from a rhinoplasty. The downtime is typically one to two weeks. It involves the first week of having an external splint if you've had some manipulation of the bridge of the nose, as well as internal splints that are very, very thin and they hug the septum. So it's not packing but it's thin splints that are in the nose for one to two weeks. There is also the potential for some bruising, especially along the bottom part of the eye, and that can be there for one week, sometimes a couple of days extra. There is also tip swelling. So that is usually noticeable to others for approximately three weeks. It will be noticeable to you for about three months. And ultimately, as that swelling starts to come down, the final appearance of the tip of your nose can sometimes take closer to a year to see the final result. I recommend light activities for one to two weeks and the sutures, if you have an external incision right here, are removed at approximately one week. So that is the recovery process from a rhinoplasty. Once again, Dr. Gary Lenkoff here from City Facial Plastics.